In regards to data protection, I mentioned that uh, cryptocurrencies, uh, when a transaction is occurring on the blockchain, because the blockchain is open and it's a distributed ledger, everyone can see what is happening. That is true, but at the same time, the blockchain is encrypted. So it means that I can see encrypted data and I can see transactions occurring between encrypted data or parts that, are, that that data has been encrypted. So I cannot actually see the contents of the, of the transaction, but I can see a transaction has occurred. Now, how it makes, how I, what makes it possible for me to actually identify a transaction is the fact that I need to know the parties that are transacting. So for example, if A is transacting with B, and I am B, and I want to know that before I transact with A, A actually has the resources or the property, because remember, blockchain can store anything, funds, real estate, art, land titles, etc. That if B wants to know that, wants to check the blockchain and see that A actually has what they're claiming they do, then B will ask A for their address. So everyone has an address, like an email address, for example, a at gmail.com. So A will provide B because I'm the one who can know my address. Because an address is, is an alphanumerical um, sentence of sorts. So once A provides B with that address, B will input that address in the blockchain and we'll be able to check and see. So unless you've provided your address to someone, there is no one who can find out what you're doing or see your transactions. So they will be able to check, does they have this? They will be able to see it openly on the, on the blockchain and confirm and then transact. So the system is encrypted. It is highly encrypted and secure. In fact, I would say it's the most secure network because today the, the Bitcoin network stores more than $400 billion worth of value. $400 billion is a very big buy. It means that every 10 minutes there's probably a hacker somewhere in the world trying to hack this network so they can steal this money. But since the Bitcoin network has launched, has never been hacked, it has never had downtime, which tells you the resilience of the blockchain. And why people believe blockchain is a, is a feature of financial technology. But everyday banks are being hacked and I won't go into that. <laughs>